porch man sits on his porch. Porch man. That song is about one of my favorite people in this world, Mr. Paul Earl. He is the real porch man. I started calling Paul porch man because whenever I was up in the morning, he was sitting on his porch. Whenever I came home from work, he was sitting on his porch. It was like, that's all you, what do you do, man? Like this is, and we, you know, over time we'd have, I'd come over to his porch, have a drink with him, sit and chat. And it's like, what? You're just, you live on this porch. Does your wife not let you in the house? I don't understand. But this, what this, that's what I hope to do one day, you know, sit on my porch, enjoying my wife, enjoying where I live, and that's what he does every day. Porch man sits on his porch. A porch man sits on his porch. When I met him originally, I was using that whole parking spot to build the foundation for my daughter's treehouse. <laughs> I took up the whole street with like two by fours. And he sits on his porch and watching me the whole time. They had just moved in. He takes you a couple weeks to get to know the people and he would, it, every day I'd go right on a trike to work or sit out on the porch and that, he was sitting on the porch every time. So I finally yelled over and I said, guitar man, what do you do for a living? I invited him to come to a gig and ever since then, man, they've been our great friends. Um, love our daughter very much and just good people. And then about a week later, Guitar Man said, Porch Man, I think I've got something for you. And he throws down three sentences for Porch Man. We played Happy Hour, he'd be like, I wrote this song about Porch Man, because that's what he would always call it. And it was just, Porch Man sits on his porch. Some men ride a Harley, some they ride a horse. Porch Man sits on him. But that was all we would play for a year. <laughs> that was all it was. <laughs> Because that's when Kelly was like, you got to finish that song. I was like, I can't rush finishing this song. You can't mess this one up. It's Three years later, he developed a full song that literally is one of the most fun songs that this island has heard. Everybody walks up to Nick after he plays the song and says, you wrote that song about me. So he's got his routine, man. He gets up in the morning and reads his paper and checks his stocks and... He's a trip, man. He sits right there for about two hours every morning. He don't do nothing but sit there and think. Porch man sits on his porch. Some men ride a Harley, some they ride a horse. When I porch man, he sits there on his porch. Living on this island, like you have a lot of friends. I have a lot of friends family here, but as far as raising a kid, you know, it's a lot of us don't have close family for babysitting and <laughs> just, you know, that family feeling like that. Guitar Man and Porch Man became best friends. He's like a brother, a son, and a best friend. You know, above that, now for me, it's more of like a mentor, I, I think, for him. I, I didn't just start to figure it out until later in life, and it's been nice to have someone kind of give me some guidance and helping out with... Uh, progressing in life, you know what I mean? Making right decisions and uh, raising a kid and raising a family and trying to do the best you can with that. So he's pretty much who I go to if I have some of those questions as well. You know, and talk, I, a lot of people think I'm, I'm smiling all the time. I'm the happiest man. He might be the happiest man there is. So that's Porch Man. <laughs>